guys, what's up? It's your boy Pixel Tour, back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. Today's video is going to be us talking about what is the best way to play PvP and gain maximum points from those games. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Pokemon Zombie Apocalypse. <laughs> Right then guys, welcome back to the video and I'm going to talk about PvP and specifically Elimination Chamber. As you guys can see, it offers 10% more currency this week, so that means 10% more super coins for your games. As well as, obviously, this is the uh, go-to PvP mode that I play in order to maximize for the rewards of the 25k. And talking about these, they have just updated them as well. They've included something called me, which was, which was previously the super coins. So I'm predicting, and this has also come from Victim Gene, as I've just spoken to him as well. So shout out to him. Uh, he thinks that there's going to be a new kind of like event, like the Valentine's Day event, where we had like the Seth Rollins or Becky Lynch we could collect for. He reckons it's going to be something similar to this, which I thought is a very, very good shout. So make sure you guys also grind the PvP to maximize your 25k because obviously like i said you get a thousand for the plus plus pack you get a you get 500 for the plus pack and you get another thousand for the normal platinum pack so if you guys could max out that you guys are looking good but with that being said i want to talk about elimination chamber so i play with a gothic all gothic deck but i have two forge two stat managers so I'll talk about that once we find a game. Right then, guys. So we've now found a game. And as you guys can see right here, power speed. So obviously, I've got toughness speed and speed charisma. So I'm just going to use the toughness speed one. Because as long as you can cover one stat that goes over 200k, you're covered. Literally, you'll win every bout now. Except if it's like uh, toughness charisma or something. Sorry, no, power charisma like this one. So this uh, this could be a coin a coin toss. Just comes down to what card he's got. My Shinsuke won that, even though I didn't have a two-stat manager on those stats. And again... Because we got toughness covered, we win that bout. Not ba that bout, sorry, that match. And again here, we had speed covered. Even though our power literally got a hit, because it got speed covered and it triple, it's basically triple of the opponent card stat, we are fine. Toughness speed, both the stats we had covered, so that card isn't going to lose regardless. Plus, now we are also down to our opponent's last card without actually having dropped a card ourselves. There you go again. Toughness speed, the meta as proven. We've won the whole bout, 6-0, not dropped a single point maximizing our pvp points we actually get from this as you guys can see 110 40 for game completion win bonus of 40 card remaining six there you go so it's five points for every card you have remaining which maximizes at 110 we get the uh 12 super coins as well and now we get the 12 picks off the board i mean i'm gonna try and keep mine because i like taking 60 off the board each time but yeah, I just thought I'd give you guys a short little pr uh, video on what is the best method of playing PvP. So if you guys have liked this video, please make sure to like button, subscribe if you're ready. Let me know in the comments section down below what you guys think. And I'll see you guys on my next video very, very soon. Peace.